What's up, squad? I want to make a video about voting for me, if you would like to, on uh, the Squad Up contest. It's Voting started today at 10 a.m. and ends at the end of the day on July 4th. So, if you want to vote for me, you just go to the Suicide Squad website, or contest website. You just go to DC Comics. It probably is on the main page, I would guess. But if not, you can just search Google for Suicide Squad, or Squad Up a cosplay contest um and then you'll click view entries and then you can search the entries and if you search Jessica mine should come up in the list and you can click on it and then you can click vote and then it'll give me a vote I think you can vote once an hour if you want I don't know for sure maybe it's just once a day but it says I already voted so I've already got one in the last hour, so I can't vote again right now. But anyway, you'll see this picture of my cosplay. Um, so I'm going to add pictures of different variations of my cosplay at the end of this video. I did recently get this new shirt from Spencer's. It has the blue at the ends and everything, and looks more like the bleedy and like the looks more like the shirt that she wears. So I think that's pretty cool, and that'll be my next Halloween and maybe next Comic-Con shirt. So, and just for fun shirt, because I really like this one. It looks more legit than any of the other ones I have, and I've had four. I am going to, like I said, I'll post like pictures of my incarnations uh, at the end of this video. I'll add them in. I'll edit the video and add them in. The reason I had to buy this shirt is I found some hot pants that weren't as... Uh, it seemed like they might stay together better and not catch up in my fishnets better and not totally get the sequins ruined as fast. But I still like my other ones because they're actually shorts and these are <laughs> more like underwear or whatever booty shorts, uh, hot pants, hot pants, or under yeah. Anyway, so if you would like to vote for me, that's how you do it. And like I said, you can vote until uh, the 4th of July. Or through the 4th of July until the end of it. Anyway. So, I just also got these two Harley Quinn comics. I'm not really sure about the gang of Harleys right now. I'm behind by one comic on this already. Or two, if you can include this one that I just got. It's just when they start not having Harley in it or going off on like a... I don't know. We'll have to see. Because I stopped reading Power Girl and uh, Harley. Harley and Power Girl or whatever because... I, I don't know, but she, it was cool that she was in the comics, like Supergirl, or Super Power Girl, <laughs> but, uh, I don't know, I mean, she was in the comics, that was a cool little thing they did, I didn't really need a mini-series of it, plus I didn't really like the art that much in that, it seemed different. And this is the new Harley Quinn, I have read this, and I love this, uh, cover. Um, what else? Oh, those are my old... Sh Old new, old shorts that I might still wear. We'll see. But I bought these because they just... I don't know. We'll see. And then I got a Gotham City Imposter shirt in the mail. They only had it in large, so it fits me like, like, a, like a night shirt, but it's still awesome. It's gray. One of my favorite colors. It has, like, uh, some of the costume pieces, the guns, the weapons in general, the bombardier. <laughs> and everything, um, yeah, the bo boomerang, all of it, the energy drink, it's all pretty cool, it's all the original stuff in GCI, Gotham City Imposters, the video game, and then, um, here is the back side of it, it has the Gotham City Imposters logo for the game, so I was pretty excited to get that, <laughs> so, I'm gonna add the pictures, um, if you wanna vote for me, Vote for me? No. <laughs> Until next time.